be on your feet for a minute. I see, I see brutal gunfire. At this okay, Texas, Dallas. Here. I see, I see brutals. Gunshot. I see somebody have lifted gun. They are throwing guns. Firing is going on. Lift up your hands. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. I rebuke it. I rebuke it. I, I'm seeing that. I'm seeing that. And I'm also seeing another one again. Somebody have entered to the airport. One of the airport. And firing. The video we were this. referencing earlier, Johnny Mohica here was inside the terminal. And he was asking at the time, what just happened? A group of people were, were running and yelling, run. And we all immediately took cover. Now, he's inside the terminal there where the seats are, the rows of seats. You can see the people ducking down behind. Now, Keep in mind, if you've ever been to Love Field, you know that's quite a distance from where the front ticket counter is. So obviously word got around with a lot of people panicked, yelling. We saw some pictures earlier on social media of people actually in the jetway heading onto the plane. And even they were looked like they were either running on or running off. Uh, so again, the details, a 37-year-old woman shot by police after she went into the restroom, came back out in a hoodie after she was Eddie Garcia out. there giving us some very brief details. He also said it's possible that the details could change as this investigation takes place. But he said at 10.59, a 37-year-old woman was dropped off at the airport near the ticket counter. She went to a restroom, came out with a hoodie or some kind of different kind of clothing on. She showed a gun and began firing. They're not sure if she was aiming at anything particular. Indications are she was shooting at the ceiling. Several rounds were fired, according to the chief. He then said an officer engaged her, shot her in her lower body, and that that woman was taken to Parkland Hospital. We're not sure of her injuries. No one else was injured. Again, this according to what we just heard from Dallas police. He says that Love Field is now secure. He said if you know someone who was flying in or flying out, that the threat is now done as we take a look from our chopper. And you can see still plenty of police cars and a police presence out here. Let's take a look at some tweets. This is from Southwest Airlines saying that they are aware of law enforcement activity at Love Field. And so they've paused departures and arrivals as they wait for additional info. Say, Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. When we see things like this, you need to pray. The last time I, I said something here, right? What did I say? I saw something. And all of a sudden, how many minutes? The last I was laying down, the Holy Spirit just woke me up and said, pray. Pray for, pray for, I think, airlines. And I put on my wall. We cancel every airline. At, and I see people put in, in the, I think, 30 minutes or 40 minutes after the post. People started putting things there about some airlines. We are praying. We cancel every attack Jesus. that will rise against this land of Texas. In the name of Jesus. This land of Dallas. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Every riot. You see the riot they did in Minnesota. I see that thing again happening. But we declare yes, that Lord. never again. May the blood of Jesus be poured on the street of this well. Jesus. We cancel and abort every plans of the enemy. In the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you. We thank you. We bless you, Lord. Yes, Lord. In the name.